Let knowledge flow like a river without any hindrance. Don't make it like a stagnant pool. Design and analysis of pi cap by action. Hello everyone. I'm Pierre Chatterjee with you. This is part seven, eight pi cap. Now I'm going to explain you how we can prepare an Excel performer for the design of eight pi cap. I hope you are going to enjoy this video. Request to my viewers. As you know, to keep your channel alive, it requires 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 organic watch hours within a year. Regarding the organic watching hour, your channel is far behind the target. And only you can provide this. Please invest your time in watching my video and also by sharing the link of my channel as many as possible. I can assure you that your investment will not go wasted. I have a lot of ideas to share with you. Eight pie scan. Type again. Dimensions of pie scan. Pipe of dimension, length is equal to LA, width is equal to LB. Spacing of pipe is equal to S. Column dimension, CX in X direction, CZ in Z direction. Dimension of passing area, BX in X direction is equal to 2 into D punch plus CX. BZ in Z direction is equal to 2 into D punch plus CZ. Overall depth D, punching depth D punch, punching load is equal to column load is equal to Fy. For 5, 7, and 9 pi scale, punching load Fy is equal to F, uh, sorry, punching load is equal to Fy minus Fy by L, where L is the number of the pi. Lever room for type 30. In x direction, jx is equal to s and zz is equal to s. Low to find cap for type time. Total cell point sw. Cell point on each file is equal to sw by 8. Say load on p1, p3, p6, and p8 is equal to r1. r1 max is equal to small is w plus fi by 8 plus absolute mx by zz divided by 3 plus absolute mz by zx by 3. R1 minimum is equal to small is w plus fi by 8 minus absolute mx by zz by 3 plus absolute mz by jx by 3. So load on P2 and P3 is equal to R2. R2 max is equal to S smallest W plus Fy by 8 plus absolute Mx by ZZ by 3. And R2 minimum is equal to smallest W plus Fy by 8 minus absolute Mz by ZZ by 3. So load on P4 and P5 is equal to R3. R3 max is equal to SW plus Fy by 8 plus absolute Mz divided by Jx divided by 3. R3 minimum is equal to SW plus Fy by 8 minus absolute Mz divided by Jx by 3. Shear force and bending moment for type 30. Maximum shear force is equal to 2 R1 max plus R2 max. Maximum bending moment Mx is equal to S into 2 into R1 max plus R2 max. Similarly for Z axis, D is equal to 2 R2 max plus R3 max. And maximum bending moment Mz is equal to S into 2 into R2 max plus R3 max. Now, I'm switching over to the Excel spreadsheet for numerical calculation. 
Welcome to a digital spacing of design and analysis of file by Tuesday. This is our service load from column. Now, look here, approximate number of file required, maximum 7.819, that is 8 files. Now I am changing 7 files cap type 2 to 8 files cap. Look here, maximum load on file under 102 load case, 581, but we have 500 only. This is our file capacity 500, center to center distance of file. Say we are changing from hard clay to friction file in clay or sand. This 1 to 50 is not sufficient. We need minimum. 1500. So I'm changing here 1500. Now it is okay. We can also change the grade of concrete, grade of steel, etc. Column dimension. Here I have considered 450 by 450 column section. Now, I'm considering increment in file capacity. It is 25%. Now, load reduction for opening and live load. Say it is 10%. Our design is OK. Now, I'm Considering the efficiency of the file. Once again, look here. Maximum load and minimum load are not okay. So, we can in increase the file capacity when it is in group up to 25%. Say we are increasing 20%. So, it will be uh, 600 our design is okay. Look here, this is our total design calculation set. Bx required, Bx available, Bz required, Bx, Bz available. L, A, L, B, load on pile P1, P2 and P3, P4, P5, P6, P7, P8. Maximum load and load case 101, 367, load case 102, 5, 454 kilonewton, and load case 102, P1 is equal to 454, P2 is equal to 400, P3 is equal to 454, P4 is equal to 454. P5 is equal to 454, P6 is equal to 445, P7 is equal to 399, P8 is equal to 449. And maximum load, uh, 101, uh, minimum load, load case 101, 325, and load case 399 kN. And in this way, this is our total design. Now say we are changing the overall depth. One zero zero three. One zero zero zero. Look here, one of us here, not okay. One one double zero design is okay. Now if we change this diameter to 20, not okay. So it will be 25. If we change this diameter 20, no, design is once again not okay. It will be 25. 
if we increase the spacing, 1, 0, 0, not OK. 1, 0, 0, not OK. But if we increase this overall depth, 1, 1, 5, 0, not OK. 1, 2, double 0, not OK. 1, 2, 5, 0, not OK. Uh, one three double zero, not okay. One three five zero, not okay. One four zero zero, not okay. We can also judge the difference. What we have to increase, either steel or depth. One second, look here, our increment maximum capacity 480 but we have 481 so we can also change we have increased 20 percent so we are increasing 25 percent that is uh, we are increasing 25 percent so it will be 6 to 5 design is okay And this is all about my design of pile cap by few clicks, part 7. I hope you enjoyed it. Part 8, that is 9 pile cap, will be released very soon. Please don't forget to subscribe my channel and also evaluate my performance with your valuable comments. Excel sheet will be distributed after the release of part 8. Thank you.